Still talking that old goblin rhyme in the sign I see? Thought it made my voice all scary and good. Truth is I'd stop it if I knew that I could. Hard habits to break. What's going on, Pete? Brains. Nothing's changed with you. Brains. Still haven't found any, I see. What's good, Colin? You can't see me. Yeah, I can. You're right there. I'm hiding? Not very well. I'm out of practice. What are you doing here anyway? I thought you were under the bed for that King Boston. Person? You are. No. Yeah, you want to see me? <coughs> Oh, you look so happy. Did you join a frat? Yeah, Chapel Yellow Group. Aww. Brains. Oh yeah, he's really smart. Oh, he's on the chess club and preaching the debate team. That's great, Colin. You must be so proud. Yeah. So, are we all here interviewing for the same job? I'd like to retire. Say enough is enough. But I got 11 miles to feed, and times are real tough. No offense, guys, but I really need this job. But I need it more. I can hide under brains, beds, or behind brains. brains, doors. Listen, Pete, you have to let me finish the rhyme, or it just feels weird. Hi, everyone. Thanks for coming. You guys are the four finalists to be the monsters under my bed. Yeah, baby! Sorry, I'm just so happy to be here. And you and me? First of all, I'm an owner. OK, hi, first of all. You have a Scottish accent? Yep, like any good ogre. Oh, are you from Scotland? No. <laughs> then why do you talk with that accent? Everyone knows ogres talk like this. It's a Shrek thing. So are you just pretending to be Scottish? A little, I guess. Are you pretending to be an ogre? No, I'm an ogre. Third, third. Okay, and what would you do? How do ogres, ogres kill people? We eat little children. But you wouldn't eat me, would you? Ah, uh, don't worry about that. If I ate you, I'd be out of a job. You're safe with me. But that's not very scary, is it? If all you can do to scare me is threaten to eat me when I know you won't, then am I really scared? I... All right, who's next? What about Colin? You can't see me. You're right there. No, no, my, what about I can see you. Well, if I had a bunch of look at me, you wouldn't see me. Not one, not of me. And how is that scary? Because you'll never know where I'll be. I could pop out of anywhere, anytime, and you'd never know. That doesn't sound scary exactly. It just sounds slightly stressful. Well, stressful is my middle name. I've got plenty of stress in my life. All right, who's Marty? That's me, ready and willing. I'll scare you to death and make your life thrilling. And you're a goblin? Through and through, tip to toe. And I can be scarier than you'll ever know. Can you do it without the rhyming? What? The rhyming. Doesn't seem scary. Yes, it does. Surely it does. I'm as scary as anyone and always was. Not really. It's scary. Super scary. You may lose your wits. The results often vary. I'm getting more of a Dr. Seuss vibe. <laughs> Makes me feel happy. <laughs> Don't say that. Okay, who is Pete? Brains. Hi, Pete. Brains. And what would you do to scare me, Pete? Arr, right? Arr. <laughs> Ooh, that's better. Thanks, Em. Hi, Pete. You know what? I don't think I want to scare you. Really? Yeah, life's scary enough anyway. I think so, too. Thanks to them. You're welcome. So you don't want to live under my bed? Oh, more than anything. I just don't want to scare you. So then what would you do? I would say supportive things. Like what? I don't know, I guess. Did you have a good day at school today? I'm really proud of you. <laughs> Thank you. And I heard that you tried out for the school play. I bet you were scared. I was terrified. But you did it. Good for you. Thank you. <laughs> and I noticed you've been playing piano. You sound really good. Wow, you noticed. I noticed. Oh, we're going to say something, too. I'll break that piano and smash it to bits. It'll haunt your dreams and scare you out of your wits. Ew, what? That's just weird. It's my grandma's piano. Why do you want to smash it? I was trying to be scary. Guys, I don't think I want scary. The world is scary enough. Thank you all for coming, but Pete, the job is yours. Pete? Pete, can you raise your What if you can hold that piano and talk? Pete, you're here, Aw. Sorry. It's okay. 